I'm Mason Peck, I'm Chief Technologist at NASA. I have the responsibility of determining the agency's priorities in technology investment. So we, in my office, we try to choose the high priority, uh, high impact technologies to invest in for the next generation of space missions. NASA's at Maker Fair today because we are uh, engaging in what's called an agency grand challenge. Uh, we have a grand challenge proposing to the nation to help NASA uh, with planetary defense. We're looking for ideas on new technologies for discovering and tracking and characterizing asteroids. Uh, we're also looking for new ideas for spacecraft that can go out and visit those asteroids and uh, understand them better. There's no imminent threat from asteroids, uh, but we do know that uh, there's uh, a large number of them out there. We have detected about 95% of the large asteroids that would be a threat to the planet, but we still only know about 1% of the asteroids that are, um, that are Earth crossing that could damage uh, property or hurt people someday. NASA's always been an agency that's focused on innovation and exploration, uh, but in the last couple of years we've stood up new programs and some, uh, even have some new opportunities for funding for people who want to work with NASA on new technologies. Uh, and that's a, a key part of what we're after here. We really are trying to reach out broadly to academia, industry, and also just individual citizens uh, to make a difference in space and aeronautics. One of my favorite things about the Maker Fair is all the energy and creativity that we see in the participants here. And people here have great ideas. They're very uh, innovative. We want to see that same kind of innovation, that same kind of creativity put into space exploration by individuals, whether that's in science or even building their own spacecraft someday.